All right, fellas. So let's start with the next inbuilt string function, which is our length function. As the name suggests, length function can just give us the length of every string, including these spaces, right? So for example, at times it might happen that you require the length of a certain string. For example, you want to put up a, you know, find out the which is the longest email ID of a customer, right? In that case, such kind of functions are helpful. Rare, but at, in, in certain cases, they are definitely helpful. The syntax again is not troubling at all. It's very simple. You use the length function and uh, you go for select length column name, the syntax more or less will remain the same uh, throughout the inbuilt function, inbuilt uh, string functions. From the table name, we click and colon and that's where the syntax is done. Let's take an example in SQL. Continuing from where we left off, let's go for select uh, star from actor. Let me look at this particular column. Let's see. Okay, a lot of uh, updates are there and let me uh, find out the length of length or I'll go for star. I'll, I want the entire data along with the length of the characters. Length, first underscore name, length, last underscore name and first underscore name as first name length. I'll just copy this and just put it over here as last name length, last name length from actor, right? So it looks like a lengthy query, but it really isn't, isn't it? It's, it's pretty simple. It's pretty simple stuff that we are doing over here, colon. And this is what I get two more columns over here, which is the first name length. This is the length of the first name, as you can see, P-E-N-E-L-O-P-E -E -E are eight letters over here. Similarly, Nick is four letters. Ed is just two letters, so it'll be great. Now I can play around with this one, right? So I can say if I uh, want to, let's say, select, uh, or probably I'll just do it over here only. I'll just copy this and put it over here. And probably I want to, you know, select certain data points based on the length of the string. For example, I want where length, in fact, I'll just copy it now. Length of the first name is greater than nine, let's say. I don't want the letters to be greater than nine. So let's see what does it work. And it does work, right? So the first name is only Christopher have a first name which is greater than nine characters, which is having 11 characters in itself. Now I want either the first name or the last name, I'll use or of course, last name to be greater than nine, right? So I'll, I want either the first name or the last name to be greater than nine. Either of them is greater than nine. I say that, give me those data points and I get it, right? So I can see that Christopher is having, Christopher Barry and Christopher West are two guys who are having first name length character greater than nine and rest of them has last name character greater than nine. And now I can see that, okay, so these are the guys where, you know, the email IDs can be slightly greater than what I'm expecting it be, right? So this is the application of length function.